Welcome back to Grizz Vision here on Grizz TV. My name is Neil Rule. We're here with Pete Hovlin and Coach. Uh, you guys, especially on the women's side, a very challenging weekend. It's always going to be challenging when you face off against Eastern Michigan. But on the women's side, you guys have essentially two meets in all about 16 hours. <laughs> yeah, who did that scheduling, huh? Yeah, that guy's got to be fired, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what was he thinking? Um, <laughs> yeah, it, it's going to be a great weekend. It's going to be a tough weekend. It's going to be extremely challenging, that's for sure. And the, the women... Uh, 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 I've put them in a situation that, uh, um, you know, where they're going to have to swim really well and they're going to have to respond because they, they are going to be challenged. Uh, uh, Duquesne, uh, Dave Sheets down there, is, is in, in Duquesne's done a great job and uh, their women um, have improved every single year that, that he's been there and they're coming in with maybe one of their better teams and uh, uh, we, we obviously can't be napping and looking past Duquesne um, uh, towards uh, our big rivalry with with Eastern Michigan because uh, uh, they they uh, they're gonna they're gonna be challenged Friday night and like you said in 16 hours we're gonna have to turn right around and come back and and swim what might be one of the deepest um, Eastern Michigan teams uh, Peter Lynn there has had in a long time and definitely on the women's side definitely contenders for the Mid American Conference Championship so we've got two teams. Um, Duquesne competing in the Atlantic 10 for a championship and Eastern Michigan women might be um, might be one of the considered one of the favorites uh, out of the max so uh, we're gonna have to be really really good this weekend and we're gonna have to be hitting on all cylinders that's for sure. Coach what is it about that matchup with Eastern Michigan I mean you guys you guys have an epic matchup with them pretty much every year that you guys take to the water against each other what is it about this rivalry that uh, makes it so great? Well I think it goes back even before I got here um, uh, uh, to Mike Jones and maybe Corey Van Fleet back in the Division Two days, uh, uh, schools just similar have, have had great, um, have, uh, outstanding facilities. Have had uh, legendary coaches. Um, my assistant used to work at Eastern. Uh, Eastern's got one of my former swimmers and, and assistants there. Uh, we we cross paths a lot in in the recruiting uh, game. Um, so there's just a, a lot of similarities, I think, and um, uh, so it just kind of brings out the best in all of us. But uh, definitely, uh, um, when when we go up against Eastern, it generally brings out the best in us. And as a coach, that's what you're hoping for. So whatever it is, it works. Hmm. Um, and uh, hopefully, uh, we respond in kind because I, I certainly know. Uh, I know the Eastern Michigan uh, kids are going to be very, very well prepared, and they'll be they'll be bringing their A game on Saturday. All right, coach. Certainly do appreciate the time. Good luck this weekend. Thanks.